Hey YouTube, this is Austin with Wreck to Death Disc Golf. Um, got another tournament today. Um, it is August 15th. I'm playing in a doubles tournament at Cottage Hill Park. It's two rounds of uh, a really interesting format. Um, it's the first six holes, you and your partner play best shot. The second six holes, you and your partner play alternating shot. And then the last six holes, you play worst shot, um, which is extra interesting to me at Cottage Hill um, to play worst shot on the that back six. Um, you know, with with 14s, the long turnover. You know, 15s as hard as it is, but they, they did say that that Rec was going to be playing a. Um, a different layout on 15 but they they haven't told us what what layout it actually is um, and you know and then 16's 16 skinny all the way down uh, 17 has that tight initial gap so um, we're shot on that that last six is gonna be uh, interesting for sure um, playing with coach frosty uh, we're both gonna be sporting the wreck to death uh, wreck to death gear. Our team name is Team Wreck to Death. Um, so, pretty excited for the first official Wreck to Death doubles tournament. Um, we haven't we've played in doubles tournaments before, but never um, never as Team Wreck to Death. We, we haven't played any doubles tournaments since I started the channel. So, um, I think there are about twenty teams in Wreck. Um, so. Should have some decent competition. Um, you know, maybe we'll even, maybe we'll even get our butts whooped. Uh, but it's it's raining today, so um, we're gonna simplify the bag down to um, you know mostly mostly base plastic. Um, so I put my my DX Beast in the bag. Um, you know, so if, if I have to, I can take, I can take the escapes out and just kind of power down on the beast and get, you know, pretty much the same flight. Um, so, so we'll see, I will see what it looks like in Mobile. Uh, right now I'm still, I'm still in George County. So, well, now I'm in Jackson County, but yeah, it's not important. Um, so I got about a, about a 40 minute drive how to chill and uh, we'll see what it looks like when we get there and uh, you know make a game time decision on uh, which discs are actually going to be in the bag for the round so we'll see I did end up going with a little bit lighter bag taking out a lot of the premium plastics um, it ended up not being nearly as wet as I thought it was going to be, so I probably could have left them in and thrown the escape on a couple of uh, the longer holes, uh, but it worked out okay. Uh, first round, uh, we scored 55, and then the second round, we scored a 61. Uh, so we finished the tournament tied, ended up going into a uh, couple of playoff holes with one of the other teams, um, and Frosty ended up uh, parking us on hole three uh, to get the win for the tournament. All right. Hey there, YouTube. This is Austin with Wreck Death Disc Golf coming at you after the tournament. Um, so, Frosty and I won the recreational division. We won. Um, so, uh, just real quick about the, the guys that put, uh, that put the tournament on. Uh, the tournament is called Fling for Wings. It's, um, it was run by a, a local uh, rehab center. Um, called the Wings for Life. Uh, I think it's Wings for Life Recovery Center or something like that. So uh, what they do is they're, they're a free um, a rehab clinic. So you know, if you're having, having trouble, struggling, you can go there and they'll take care of you for free and get you back on track. So, um, so big thanks to them for putting on the tournament. Um, and and uh, Jesus Freaks too. Jesus yeah, Freaks Jesus too. Jesus Freaks yeah, too. Thanks yeah. to the Jesus Freaks. Um, so we, we did the the first six, middle six, last six uh, format. Uh, so we get Coach Frosty to talk to you all a little bit about that and how that went and, and 
get his take on you know, whether he likes it, whether he doesn't, you know, all that good stuff. So. Yeah. Well, it was, first of all, the whole tournament was fun. Uh, and I liked the different format. Instead of just playing like we always play every weekend, it, it, it pre created some challenges for us. Um, very, <laughs> very challenging on the worst shot because that was on the last six holes, hole 13 through 18. And that is pretty much the most difficult part of the course. Um, there's a, in the middle there, there's a bad stretch. So that was difficult, but I love the challenge. Everybody's playing the same format, so no big deal. Now we actually were fortunate and we started in the middle of the last six, both rounds. So we kind of only had about half the bad, uh, half of the worst shots yeah. before we got to best shot. And then we came back around and finished on worst shot. And I think that helped us a little bit, just kind of settle us into it. Instead of starting with the first six holes playing worst shot, uh, I thought that was better for us. And uh, and I thought we did pretty well. Uh, we definitely did great on the front, and I thought we uh, we dominated the alternating shots, which can be very tricky too, because when you're playing your partner's throw and you're alternating every shot. There's no second chance. No second chances. So the pressure's on. Um, you know, you don't have your partner to back you up when you miss a putt and uh, he's just got to tap it in. But all in all, I, I like the format. Wouldn't want to play it every day, um, <laughs> but definitely like the challenge. And like, like, like we're saying, you know, everybody's playing that format. So, and we, we, we played two practice rounds before and, uh, you know, got better from one round to the next and then um, did well today. So pleased with it, enjoyed it. Yeah, definitely. And I, 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 think you're, I think you're exactly right about, you know, splitting the worst shot into the, you know, first couple of holes and the last couple of holes. Yes. Um, just from the standpoint of that worst shot, um, those holes, it's very like mentally and emotionally taxing. It's it's tough on a team. Like um, the first round when we played 15, mm -hmm. we both had we both threw putters straight up the gap. We were maybe 12 feet out. Yeah. Coach Frosty hits his putt and I miss and go down the hill. And then coming back up, Frosty hits his putt, and I miss, and we turn a two into a four real quick. And uh, so it, it's it's just tough having you know to have several of those back to back. Where if you get to break them up, then you know it's it's easier to kind of forget your mistakes and and um, and kind of reset mentally. Um, well, and, so. I, and I think that's where when you're used to playing best shot all the time, you never think about the worst shot. Right. And so now that you're playing worst shot, and you really you realize. Because I never give a worst shot a second thought when we're playing regular right. doubles. You just pick it up and go. Now you're actually sometimes you a... forget it to the point where you don't go pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> it could be just yeah. way over there. Just leave yeah. that guy yeah. in the woods. And uh, so I I thought that that just showed how difficult it is. And then when we were talking to Trey earlier today, it's a great way to practice. Throw two, you know, if you're doing a practice round, throw the two off the box, and then play your worst shot, and then the two putts to to finish uh, as well. It's very challenging. So, uh, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, again, thanks to uh, the Wings of Life uh, Recovery Center uh, for putting on the tournament, um, and uh, thanks to Coach Frosty for uh, for for carrying my butt. Oh, come on! <laughs> team effort. It says t first letter right here. First word. Team wrecked to death. So that's right. team effort. Good job, Coach. Got the W. Feels great. Woo! See the line and get after it. <laughs> See the line and get after it.